Midnight last night. Who were you talking to? If you don't speak, I can't help you. My mother. And you talk to her often? It varies. I speak when she rings me. And she rings you often? I see. And that makes you happy. What else makes you happy? You need to talk more. Quit being a dick. You're fucking this up for yourself. You need to talk. This will only help if you cooperate with me. We need to get to the bottom of this. We need to make sure you are able to exist in the outside world. You want that, don't you? Reading. One stuttery, feeble word. Yeah, that's going to get you out of here. Look at your hands shaking. Speak. Reading books and things. When I read, I can be anyone. I'm Hamlet in a turmoil. I scavenge with Oliver Twist. I live a million lives in a million places and times. It's indestructible. I'm indestructible. Indestructible? That, that's an interesting... Uh, the main characters leave the pages at the end of the book, but the story isn't over. It continues and it plays in my mind. Mark and Elizabeth have four children. These people aren't real. They're characters. Uh, and Kevin served his time and visited the school. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Referencing a psychopath. Uh, and the Craig has split into groups and built towns and villages in a hierarchical society. Shall we take a break? Look at her. She's on to you. Shut the fuck up. And Snowman lives in a lonely cell knowing he's isolated by human frailty. And he's ugly and broken and impure and he wants to get out but he's trapped! What happened? You heard it again, didn't you? Which voice? My own. Louder, angrier. I'm getting worse, aren't I? Is that what you think? Sorry. I got waylaid. Yes. I'm on my way. Yes. I'm fine. Yes. Yes. I'll pick some up. <laughs>